Hello folks, this is Harley with MI Squared. I have a brief message for you on the topic of MIPS, officially known as the Merit-Based Incentive Payment System. We at MI Squared and our associates have developed a tool that simplifies MIPS and RAF HCC reporting from requiring dozens of time-consuming decisions and steps down to just a few. Well, let's get right to looking at it, shall we? With this tool and MI Squared's registry service, you only need to make two decisions to get rolling on your MIPS reimbursements. First, what time period you're reporting on, and second, which measures you want to use. That's it. And we'll help you out with those decisions too. We can help you select the measures that reflect your practice workflows so you don't have to make your providers change their treatment routines. We can help you locate the data files to use for your reporting. We walk you through using the tools, answering all your questions until you're comfortable with your part of the process. And if needed, we also provide services to help you extract missing data from other sources, such as your EHR database. Finally, we are the registry agent. Once you have the report you're happy with, we take it off your hands and submit it to CMS, on time and correct. It's just five easy steps. Collect your claim files. Select your measures. Create the report. Correct the deficiencies. Send it off. Now let's take a closer look at that short sequence of steps. The first step you do only once for each reimbursement, collect your claim files. Simply assemble into a zip archive the billing claim files from the reporting period. Then, for each report you want to run, select your measures, which can be selected from the individual measures listed at the bottom here, or you can use the specialty sets, which are collections of measures tailored to your practice's specialty. Then you run the report, setting the report date range, the report type, and the providers to report on. The report lists the measures and the number of records in each category. Correct the records in measures that are not met by adding the missing information so that they will be counted in the MIPS report performance rates. When all the corrections are made and you're happy with your totals, send the report off to us. That really is as complex as MIPS reporting needs to be. I don't know why so many other vendors don't see it that way, but it can be that simple for you. If you'd like to find out more about our MIPS reporting service, please contact us at info at misquared.com, spelled as you see it on the screen, or call Tony at 713-574-6709. Thank you very much for the time you've invested to review this video. We're looking forward to working with you.